I'm calling it right now. We're about to hear an indie cover of Teenage Dirtbag that sounds like this. Cause I'm just a teenage dirtbag, baby. To some fucking acoustic music, like they're trying to make it sad or something. I don't know. Mark Twain when Mark Firetruck walks. Green or blue? This little fucking asshole, get off, look at you just dragging your ass on my fucking clean car, you piece of shit. Fly me to the moon, let me play among the stars. Was a major cause of the Renaissance. Oh, más. Vamos a ver qué es el Juan Pi. Ja, oh shit, Mikey Jackson! Shavlar! Han moonwalker ut i skog! Dog! Just killed so this, I made that video about Billion Surprise Toys. There were videos Put a gun a against his head. Well, not Pulled my the trigger and now he's dead. I don't understand! What do you mean? I don't understand! Man, shut the f Does anybody know where I could beat the dragon in Minecraft? At the end. Thanks for coming. Hi, thank you for having me. Of course. I brought paper dolls. Oh, uh. Hello, my name is Mark. My mother named me Mark. On Earth, I am known as Mark. Wow, this spread looks delicious. I think I'll start with the hamburger, or, or the fruit would be the normal thing to start with. What is he doing over there? No, it's no, no. Mark, Mark, Mark. Where to go? Where is your lavatory? It's right around the corner. Thank you. What the? Those are not my paper towels. Why is he using them? What do you mean you don't sleep suspended from the ceiling? <laughs> whoa, whoa, wait. Brian, a word, please. That cornhole sack I threw just re-entered the atmosphere. And it's going to decimate half of Los Angeles. Oh my god. like no goals, not too modern. Obviously we need Wi-Fi. Cabin crew on doors, Koshik and Rip.
thirsty, thirsty Thursday. Yo, the lid, yo, the lid. Yo, the lid, yo, the lid. Yo, the lid. And now I want to sit back and relax and enjoy my evening. When all of a sudden I hear this agitating, grating voice. Friends of another Arabian night. Arabian night, like Arabian days. And every day's a dream when I'm carrying your love with me. I'm carrying your love with me. The Blue Gatorade. Every single time you drink it, it's like, ah. Uh, Here I am, once again. Hey, no, stop. Just calm down. Don't do it. What'd you say? Nothing, mate. No one said nothing. Let me tell you something right now. I built this team from the ground up, and there is no fucking way that anyone is gonna take it away from me. If there was a dating app in the Pokemon world, do you think your Pokemon team would serve the same function as your hobbies and interests? Like, it's the surface level thing you put out into the world so you can be scrutinized by a potential partner, but not for anything that, like, matters? I feel like there would be some pretty one-to-one -one parallels, like that guy who's holding a fishy cot in his profile picture? That is a fisherman with a team of six Magikarp. Like, it's not a red flag, but if you're not into fishing, you're in for a bad time. Like, if you have a Pikachu on your team and you go out of your way to say, oh, Pikachu's my favorite Pokemon, that'd be the equivalent of saying The Office is your favorite TV show. Like, I get it, I respect it, it's popular for a reason, but it's just a very boring stance to take. Just looking for someone to go on an adventure with me and my Pikachu. Someone with a team of six dittos is the equivalent of someone just coming right out the gate saying they're super into anime. Like, during conversation number one, they're showing off their figurine collection. Yes, there is a perfectly fine chance that they are using these dittos in figurines for normal, non-bad things, but do you want to take that chance? Like, if you don't work at a Pokemon daycare, six dittos is a red flag, no question. And then you meet someone who only lists three Pokemon, you're like, that's weird, why only three Pokemon? And they're like, oh, I'm just a three Pokemon kind of person. But it only comes out later that it's because they're part of a double battles team and they're cheating on their partner. Obviously the other person had the other three Pokemon, how could you be so stupid? And then you meet someone whose team is like, Zubat, Houndoom, Geodude, and you're like, eh, do you do crimes? And they're like, no, why would you ask that? And you're like, they're te your team, dude. And they come back with, uh, no, actually, uh, uh, I'm just a mountain climber and I really like caves. But you're wearing your grunt uniform in your profile pic. You're not fooling anyone, grunt Dave. Then you see someone with just a mine unlisted with the caption looking for the plessel to my mine on. And then you vomit. You just vomit. You've taken in too much metaphorical sugar and you just vomit. And when you're done cleaning that up, you keep swiping or scrolling or whatever. I'm not very experienced. That might be clear at this point. But you see someone with a mono ghost type team and you text them and they never get back to you for some... Oh. You have the night off, you match with someone whose only listed Pokemon is mixing, no, and you're like, how'd they do that? And the next thing you know, your identity's been theft. Bro, bro, I'm about to get fucking fired, bro. I'm about to get Bro, I'm about to get fucking fired. Yo, they got the fuck out of me. This week, a hot new bombshell enters the villa. Don't call me up, I'm going out tonight, feeling good. Oh my god, she ain't talking about that. Hey, she ain't talking about my little baby on. You should date Pete Davidson. Mom, I can't, he's a comedian. 
Well, he should like him because you're a fucking dog. <laughs> this is Bowser. He's got fleas. This is Stephanie. She's dumb as shit. The hoes gonna love this. slip into something a little more comfortable. <laughs> John, I get the Minecraft cheese it. You are one of my best friends in the whole world, and I just, I don't know if I feel the same. I'm so sorry. Um, I, I'm sorry, Jules. I'm sorry, Jules! Darkness, my old friend I've come to talk with you again Because a vision softly creeping Left its seeds while I was sleeping Hey! This you taken? Cool. You know I- Nice hat, new kid. Fillmore rules! Marcus Fillmore. Legend has it he had an original thought once. It died of loneliness. <laughs> Guess you can't really control the hinder dealt in high school, huh? You got your kings, your queens, and your jokers. But somehow you always manage to ace it. <laughs> Magic tricks. Not exactly the look I should be going for, but uh, here's my number. Let me know if you ever want a Plago fish. You sure have one hell of a poker face. Do 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 do. do. God damn, these cats are cooking. Oh, they're swinging. Fuck. You have to stop drinking that. It's going to kill you. Yeah, the day that I stopped drinking is the day that famous drummer Ringo Starr of the Beatles posts fee pics on his professional Instagram. The day he posts two fee pics. The day uh, they make his head out of soap. And no. they make my head out of soap. Uh, um. Anyone at 60 should be shot. Five gum. Stimulate your clitoris. Four quarters for this dollar? Oh yeah, no problem. <laughs> hey man, did you just take those out of my cart? Cause like that is, holy shit, what is the- <gasps> Hey, listen, it's cool. I didn't even really need them like that. So if you want them, you can keep- <laughs> Okay. This is my pitch for a Cupcake X Fan of the Opera Remix, except I do not have the editing software and knowledge to do it. So I will just be performing all parts myself. Smack my ass like the drum. Slurp, slurp that dick.